Hello video family, this is Tish, looking exactly the same, right? A year later. But boy, have I been through some stuff. But I wanted to update because I'm really happy with my hair. So I'm still doing the same hair regimen. But um, I wa wanted to show you I have simplified my products for, you know, more than one reason. But um, mostly money. <laughs> so I have some empties, some stuff that I want to show you that I love um, and one thing that I didn't care so much about and then I'll pull my hair all apart so I can show you but I mean you can see it's thinner I mean it's it's filled in more all right here was but it's still thin you know I'm still not happy with it but it's better than it was but you have to go back and watch the old the old video which you can see on my blog which I'll put a link to okay so I'm still doing, here's my little bottle and you can see it is almost empty. It's time to make more. So I'm still using the castor oil. Same castor oil with coconut oil. Right? Trader Joe's um, with tea tree oil and rosemary oil which I don't have those but you know you can get them and you just put a little bit of the tea tree oil because it's very strong and has a strong smell and well I would say six to seven drops is what I use and then two or three drops of the rosemary oil because that has a strong smell too which I don't like but you need the rosemary because it's an activating oil and I really believe that helps because I've used it without the rosemary oil in it and it didn't seem to have the same effect maybe I'm just you know maybe it's a psychological thing but hey and you know you get one bottle of, of the rosemary oil and it lasts for a really long time so okay my favorite favorite okay the shampoo that I use now is just Trader Joe's tea tree shampoo and the conditioner and it's the one I should have had the bottle but my son was in the bathroom um, it's like $3.99 and it's the weird shaped bottle it's not the one that says spa on it because they have two now and if I can I'll put a picture or something in the link um, look at Michael Jackson back there it's my sister-in-law she loves Michael Jackson anyway um, so I'm still just, so I use that on my scalp, and, um, you know, it's still washing my hair that way, just washing the scalp, not the whole end of the hair. So, that's that, you know, wash my hair however often, not that often still, um, and so, now, I have all these conditioners. Now, the Trader Joe's conditioner is a great detangler if you know when you're gonna comb your hair so I put that in a spray bottle which I don't have here with water just enough water so that it can squirt through the bottle because you know if you just have too much conditioner then it won't squirt through so just enough for that and I use distilled water not distilled but you know bottled water not regular um, tap water and just squirt that in and you know comb it out so then after I rinse that out this right here oh my goodness this has to be my new favorite I don't know if it's new but it's new to me cream of nature argon oil it smells good mm. I don't even know I can't even tell you what it smells like it smells good it's just the bomb you gotta try it and that is my leave-in um, if I'm just gonna wet my hair and just pull it back I use this leave it in love this you can see it is almost empty right you see that I will be buying this again now every night or not every night because I don't do anything every day I'm just not <laughs> consistent like that but 
when I think about it, this right here, and I know I talked about it before, I'm still using this. I love this. I love the way it makes my hair feel. I really believe it's helping to strengthen it, but it stinks. It, I don't, it smells like, mm, what is it? It smells like if you use public bathrooms at the movies, the soap. The soap from the public bathroom at the movies. That's what it smells like. But the good thing is the smell doesn't stay. It goes away. So what is it? It has marigold, chamomile, soy, which I'm not so happy about, lemongrass, aloe vera, vitamin E, and it's henna and biotin. And it's not that expensive. Matter of fact, all these things are less than $10. Okay? Um, and it says for normal or color treated hair. And I get this at Whole Foods and only certain Whole Foods have it. Not all. So you see I already have my other one. Look at my hair. Uh, well, they don't have the line. You know, I really like when they put the clear line right here so you can see how much you have. Why don't they all do that? Only some of them do that. They should all do that. I'm going to write a letter. No, uh, see, like this. This is what I'm talking about. They have a clear streak so you can see where you are. Okay. Still using this. Still love this. And this is empty. See, you can see. So I'll be repurchasing this. The restorative conditioner. Everybody and their mama talk about it on YouTube. Love it. This love this this is almost empty um and whole foods again everyday shea butter conditioner detangler babies and ups when i bought this it was less than five dollars it was 4.99 now it's up to 6.99 but i love this this is a good detangler as well very good detangler okay this was the one product. Oh, I'll hold off on that. I use that. I really like this. Apogee Keratin and Green Tea Restructurizer. Um, it, so when I go to bed at night, I take my hair down. Woo, seven minutes. Let me hurry up. Take my hair down. Spray this. When well, you see it's running out, spray it on the ends. Spray it. And then I take this conditioner and rub that through also through the ends I part it you know down the middle and put it there okay so now let me hurry up oh this right here there was a little I'm calling her little because she looks little but she's in the Navy or Army or something and they move her around quite a bit she was the first one I heard talk about this I love this I don't use it as a conditioner I use it as I guess it would be a holding product and not only do I use it, but my other my son uses it. He kind of has hair like mine. He uses it too. And it smells mm, so good. Oh, the Gardini. And they have other ones. They have a cocoa butter one that doesn't smell as good as this one. I think they have a Freesia one too. But this one, the Gardenia one. And you see it says so smooth. And that is what it does. It smooths down. But this is what I when I wear my hair down, curly. I put this, this is the product that I use to hold it. So let's see. Okay, if you remember before, my Widow's Peak was not hardly even there. And look at it now. It's longer, it's past my nose. Sorry if you can hear the helicopters. Let me close my eyes so I can um, show you. You see that? This, all of this was not here. So it's been... A year and a half I think I'll check for sure maybe two years I don't know but you can see the difference of the hair right and I have this all over my whole head um, so I'm really happy you know like I said because I'm not doing anything crazy no crazy trying to remedies I'm just trying to take care of my hair and stuff and these this wasn't here before either and it's thicker and I can pull on it and nothing is coming out and before if I went like this every time I went like that hair would come out okay I'm gonna end it here because it is almost 10 minutes thank you for watching if you have any questions question you know and I'll try to get 
to it. I'm trying to be more focused on my blog and, and everything now because I know people are like, where are you? I sent you a question and I haven't heard from you. But I'm going to try to get back on track. And thanks for watching. I hope this helped. Actually, I had two other products, but I want to end this. It's a long video. Thanks for watching. Bless and be blessed. And I'll see you in the next video.